In this video, I'm going to use Google Chrome to download a Windows 10 version 1803 installation ISO using direct download links. So I'm going to open up Google Chrome and I'm going to search for download Windows 10 and this will take me to the landing page for the Windows 10 download. Now because I'm running Windows 10 or Windows 7 or Windows 8.1 or Windows 8, it will take me directly to the Windows 10 media creation tool. Now I actually don't want to use the media creation tool so I'm going to press F12 to get to developer options. I'm going to change the view so I view it as a mobile device and then I'm going to refresh. So now we see that we've got a slightly different page and I can revert this back to the desktop view and then I can close developer options. So now I've just got the option to select my edition and the only edition is Windows 10 and the direct download links are a multi edition installation ISO. They actually have even more editions than the multi edition ISO created by the Windows 10 media creation tool. Although the Pro Education and Pro Workstation licenses are generally for large organizations and aren't OEM or retail licenses. So we'll select Windows 10 as the edition which will give us the multi-edition ISO and then we'll be given the option to select language. So for English, Microsoft lists two installation ISOs, English International and English. The English International ISO is the English UK installation ISO and the English ISO is the English USA installation ISO. I don't know why they don't just call them English UK and English USA but make sure you don't download the English USA one by mistake. So I've downloaded the four installation ISOs, the two English UK ones and the two English USA ones. And now I'm going to download Rufus and I'm going to use it to check the checksums of the ISOs. Now it's always recommended to do this because an installation ISO is a large file and if you're using a direct download link you may get an incomplete ISO. So what we're going to do is open up Rufus, load the installation ISO and then press the hash at the bottom to get the checksums. Here are the checksums for both the English UK and English USA installation ISOs. So make sure your installation ISOs match these. So the file names in blue and the checksums are below.